Okay. Once you're in treatment and you've given your drugs, your iron, your EPO or your clexane, we can then start to turn the blood flow up. We need to check that the machine pressures are okay. So you need to be checking your venous pressure, your arterial pressure, and we also need to be checking the affluent pressure. So the V comes just after the time and looks like a U. You can see here it's at 86, 87, which is absolutely fine. But we're gonna check the arterial just to make sure that's okay. That's at 55. So we're gonna start to turn the blood flow up. I tend to turn it up in 50 mil segments and just keep checking and assessing. The venous pressure should always be about half, if not less, unless your nurse specifies otherwise. If the pressures still remain good, then we can carry on turning it up. <coughs> your nurse will also recommend to you what blood flow speed they recommend you to have. So do ask your nurse. But we're gonna put this patient at about 350. And as you can see, the venous pressure is 128, which is well below half. The effluent is sitting at 34, which is absolutely fine. And the arterial is 99. 